All right, guys. We're out here this morning. Uh, <laughs> started to rain on me, so I didn't do an intro until it stopped. But uh, we're in this beautiful river right here. Check that out. So I already caught two bass, uh, one off of a log and the other one off of some rocks uh, on top water. So I didn't film it because it was pouring, so I'm soaking wet. So let's see what this day brings now. But uh, stay tuned and don't forget to subscribe, share, and like. Thank you. all Today was going to be overcast, so most of the day to like to a cool that's a nice one what is it is it a smallie oh it was a nice spot oh i got off dude it's like a three pound spot oh i got my heart going <laughs> i'm gonna buy it was gonna be overcast most of the morning, up to like one o'clock. I was under a tree for like 30 minutes. It was, it was pouring. Oh, that was so awesome. Let me hit up this tree with um, with the jig. So let's back out. To the edge. He just slurped it. It didn't blow up or anything. He just slurped it. I was hoping for a blow up, but I'll take that. Oh, e. <laughs> Something hit it there. Oh, what happened? Great. Balls of fire. Oh, it's going to be a good day. It's gonna be a good day. It's gonna be a good day. Ooh, there's another one. Like in that top water. Oh, this is a green bass. This is a bass bass. Oh, and another one got Darn it, that's two. That's actually three. Last three. I said I was gonna toss the jig. I have it. Let's get stuck over here. I just got another hit. Oh, he has it. He's messing with it. But he won't take it, it's too big for him. Oh, there he is. Oh, it's a nice bag. Why where he should be? Oh yes. This is a spot. This is a spotted bass. They have that rough patch in their tongue. Beautiful bass. Nice, nice. All right. Oh, 
Nice. I like, I like to have options, so I always keep a rod ready. Especially when, when you see that kind of branches or structure in the water. I'll throw the other option I have. Oh, I thought something had it in. It fell on top of a branch, so. It's still dragging on something. Oh, now a fish has it. Oh, yeah. He got him. He got him. Another spot. Oh, he destroyed the, the cracking crawl. He's a chunky one. Sorry. Check that little football out. <laughs> Get that gut. It's awesome. Destroy that cracking crow. <laughs> Another spotted bass. There's a tiny one on the buzz bait. They're so warm. Check that out. Tiny one though. It just, ah, oh, it fell and he just nipped it. It's crazy. Oh, that's another one. <laughs> Man, they're munching. Beautiful. Tiny though. Need something twice as big. Oh yeah, another one. They're all spots though. <laughs> I like them at J. Oh, there's a scar right there. Hmm. Beautiful bass. Right. Let you go. But the cracking crawl is dead. So we're gonna switch them out. So peaceful. Right. I'm glad I found this spot. It, it uh, it's a little harder to access. So there's not a lot of traffic. Unless you own a home on the river, and of course. Oh, of course you could access it.
Wait. Damn, not where I wanted it. That's what I like about the buzz bait. You can throw it literally anywhere. It's not casting right. Ooh, like I said. Oh, he let it go. There's smaller bass. You're just hitting the tail. It's those rocks. I stained those rocks. Oh, there's another one. Okay. That one got it. Oh, man. That's a nice one. Jump again. You done? You got oh. No! He got away! <laughs> ah, that was a nice spot of bear. Something hit it again. Oh. He destroyed that tail. Those rocks are just calling. Oh, oh I caught another one and it wasn't even working right. Okay, don't, don't get off. Golly. Grass are like so aggressive. <laughs> I get that another little chunk. Get that stomach. <laughs> All right. Buzz Bay put in some work again. Sheesh. All right, gotta clean the lens. <laughs> there we go. Back to business. Man, that was, that was a nice little sequence. <laughs> Throw the jig out there. Can't ask for much. Well, all I want is <laughs> maybe a three pound spotty. Yee. Oh, something has it. Come on, take it, take it, take it, take it, take it, buddy. Do you have it? You got it. Oh, it's a tiny one. <laughs> oh, he just tore the Kraken Crow into pieces. Tiny, oop. No. Tiny little bass. Oh. I don't know if y'all saw that, but. Something came up and hit something over there. That's the last of the cracking crawl. I thought I had a another bag of cracking crawls and I don't. So bandito bug it is as a trailer. That one took one of the damn it. There's another one. I went ahead and switched out. To the Bandito Bug trailer. Yeah, this one's a little lighter. Still chunky. All right, buddy. Now he took one of, oh, he took both of the appendages. Darn it. Come on, I just want a nice one on, on top water. That'll happen. 
the skies are clearing up though. I need top water. The top water bite is gonna go away. And it looks like there's a lot of shade in this river, so they still pay off. And then I came to just explore and see if I could get the kayak down. The water was a lot more clear. It's been raining, so there's a little stain to it. I caught a little bass off of the bank with top water, so. Oh, come on. Oh, he had it. Must have been small. Oh, he got it. This time he got it. He got it. He's tidy though. I skipped him on top. <laughs> I knew there was gonna be something on that edge. Right, come on. So beautiful. Check that out. Very healthy. Alright. Back you go. <laughs> Hit it twice. Oh, there's someone in the woods over there. I can hear him talking. There's a trout laying there too. Oh, this whole edge right here. Don't do that to me. Don't let me go. Oh, the biggest one of the day. Right there. The nice one. I'm the old bandito bug. Check that out. A nice little chunk. Cool. Take a picture. Let her go. Come on. Let her go. It's a nice one. Bye, girl. <laughs> yeah, let's continue. If I could fish it off from the edge, I'll fish it. I'm in a little island anyway, so nobody owns this little piece because it's in the river. Those were the other the guys were over there checking out the spot and I didn't want to be intruding, so I didn't get close to that edge. Does he have it? No, he doesn't. Oh, 
I think he has it now. Yep, he has it now. Come on. Oh, if he was, oh no, he let go. No. No, he was. It felt like a nice one. So we're looking for. Ah. Wow. I didn't want him to jump and. Maybe the way I moved my rod down helped him to escape. It felt like a nice one too. Darn. And yeah, he can't win them all. It's all right. Like I cast it in there and just pop it and just whack, bong, smack, <laughs> all kinds of noise. Caught it like top water. Oh. I don't know if the GoPro caught that, but he caught it outside of the water. It was awesome. He already has it. Yep. Come. Come. Baby. Oh, he let it go. Oh, no. Man, I set the hook on there like there is no tomorrow. What? No. Oh, something has it again. Come on, take it, baby. Take it. Ah. God, you got to be kidding me. How? They gotta be tiny. That's the second one in a row. How? He has it again. Munching on it. I don't let him eat it. Okay, set the hook. Nope. They're small. What is going on? Come on. Third time's the charm. Hit it once. You have it. Swim with it. He swim with it. Now I said, oh. oh my good lord, god darn it, again, he has to be small. He's just playing with it, like, you can see the line, it gets tight, he takes it, he's hitting on it. Oh, this one's a tiny one. I'm just going to drag him to the rock. He wants to play with him. Okay, this time I got him. I got him. Oh, he's a nice one. I don't know why he wasn't committing to it then. Oh, that's a nice bass. The nicest of the trip. Why? Did, I don't get it. Why wasn't he taking it? Like, yeah, 
Darn it, that's like the one I lost the first time. He was barely hooked. Wow. The Guggenrod and the Cast King doing its job. Sweet. Golly, I'm so excited. <laughs> Woo! Check that out. Like, wow. Okay. Give me a little bit of water. Oh, she's ready. She's ready to go. Get those colors on there. Take a picture. I will release her. Nice. She's not even fighting. Yeah. Nice spotted bass. Shoot. Big ol' eyes. Look at those eyes. Can't believe it. She hit it four times. Four times. She was just playing with it. We're going to release her back. She's ready. Get those colors on it. Go, baby. There she goes. Just give it a little stun. She's going. She's gone. Oh, man. What a day. What a day. This is awesome. I didn't press the button. Uh, I tossed it out the same place again. Something caught it again. This time it broke me off. It felt heavier than that other one. I, it broke me off, so that's the last jig I had. I only had two. One got messed up, and then I got broke off right now. So, old trusty Texas rig. I hope it does the job. They hit it back to back, so I, I just. I'm speechless. What's down there? Going with the old bandito bug, Texas rig. See, it pays off. Maybe it's just one in the jig, though. Anymore, but this part looked too juicy and yeah. I caught me another one <laughs> they're chunks uh, the Texas Rick Bandito I don't know they're all spots though I think I've ever been to a place where I only catch spots so that's awesome different adventure one more cool nice little chunky okay there we go Beautiful color on there. All right, let's go. <laughs> All right, guys. As you can see, it's it's pretty bright now. So that was a good four hours of fishing, or about three, because the rain kept me under a tree for like 30 minutes. But that's it. We will catch on next time. It was a great day. I've never had a day with all the spots I caught. That's that's great. That's never happened before. So I'm enjoying this river. I will be back to this section of the river and hopefully catch whatever I lost back there. I, I lost a, a nice uh, bass. I don't know what it was. Maybe it was a catfish. I've been wanting a catfish on a jig. So I got to restock on jigs, restock on, on some cracking, restock on cracking craws and bandito bugs. So until next time, make sure you subscribe, like, and share, guys. Oh, and don't forget, check the description. I'll leave the links for the baits and the gear I was using. Thank you all. Have a good day.